Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, and I host the Valder Beebe Show on FM radio and internet television. I am famously known for that celebrity interview, which I conduct by cell phone, in studio, or satellite media tours. Go to ValderBeebeShow.com, YouTube.com slash Show, or our partnership network with Business in the Black, which is BlackSuccessAcademy.com, and click on the Valder BB Show channel. I'll see you there. opportunity to speak to John Stein. He's the CEO of Betterment, and he's right here on the Valder Beebe Show to talk about five life events that affect your finances and how you can deal with them. John, thank you for bringing answers for my audience. Well, thank you for having me, Valder. It's great to be with you. I'm a, I'm a Dallas native myself. Oh, okay. Well, you, hey, you know some of the problems we have here. Can you briefly tell me the five life events and then give us some ways that we can deal with them? Yeah, well, as people are thinking about changes and life events, that's often the time when they're thinking about managing their money. And one change that many people are going through from time to time is they're changing jobs. Changing jobs is a great time to think about the long term and resetting your finances. Maybe you're making more money, you can save a little bit more if you're lucky. Uh, but almost everybody who's changing jobs has the opportunity to roll over their old 401ks that are hanging out into one IRA where they can manage it better in one place. So it's much easier to manage your money in one IRA than a bunch of old 401ks hanging out. You might also save on fees by rolling over. Many people don't know what they're paying in 401k fees, but if you look for a low cost IRA, you can save money, which helps you actually have more money and make that money work harder for you if you're not paying it, uh, paying it to your financial advisor. Another thing people should think about as they're uh, changing jobs is maxing out their 401k, at least to the point where they're getting a match. If you have a match at your, at your new employer, make sure you're maxing out to get that match. Otherwise, you might just be leaving money on the table. Okay. You gave us some great ideas, but let me ask you this. A lot of us are rolling over, but we're going into business for ourselves. Is there a place for us as entrepreneurs? There are ways that people who are starting their own businesses can save just as much as people who have 401ks. You can open what's called a SEP IRA, uh, and that uh, uh, allows you to manage uh, more money even than you can in, in most 401ks in an IRA-like account. That's a great way for self-employed people, uh, SEP stands for self-employed, uh, uh, to save uh, more for their retirement. You know, there's other life events that people should be thinking about, but uh, you know, today people have to save more money than ever, and that's why setting up a SEP or a 401k is so important. It costs more to, 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 to go through retirement than it ever has because we're living longer, which is a great thing, but it also means we have to save more money in order to pre prepare for it. We also have more health care costs as we live longer, uh, and as health care becomes more expensive, and all of that can be pretty intimidating to people starting out in retirement savings. So some people just avoid it altogether. That's not the right response. Uh, the, the good news is it's easier than ever to get started. There are tools out there today that tell you what accounts to open, how much money to save in each account. They'll set a full retirement plan for you and help you stay on track to retirement over time. These tools are now accessible to anyone and there's no minimum balance, no minimum fees. So this is the best time that it ever has been to start saving for retirement, even though it can seem intimidating to get started. It's now easier than ever. Okay, so you're right on target. I got one Facebook question I'm going to take this morning. My audience is made up of baby boomers, and 89.9% .9 of those baby boomers are female. That's, it. That's the incredible part. They want to know, according to this uh, Facebook post, can they do this themselves? You kind of answered that, but they want to know, can they do this themselves? You can manage your money yourself. And really, the, the decision about whether you want advice or not uh, is up to you. I'll tell you, at Betterment, we offer advice with CFPs who are uh, you know, highly qualified advisors, the best out there. 
and they'll give advice if you want it on the phone or via email or messaging or however you want to talk to us. That advice is accessible to anyone. There's no minimum balance. There's no minimum fee. Uh, so uh, that kind of advice has never been so accessible as it is today. Uh, but whether you want that or not is really up to you. Some people feel really comfortable managing everything themselves. I recommend that everyone get an advisor of some sort because an advisor like Betterment can manage your money better for you than you can manage it yourself. We can take advantage of tax opportunities that you can't if you're just managing your own accounts. We can reduce your taxes as a result and generate more of your money for you. We can help you make the most of all of your savings. Well, John Stein, CEO of Betterment, I think that's the best advice of all. My audience, they want to get more information as a wrap-up. Where could I send this? Anyone can come to Betterment.com and learn more. We've got lots of great articles and content there to help you understand life events and how to make the most of your money. You've been a very, very good interview, John Stein, CEO of Betterment. Thank you for your time, and thank you for helping my audience on the Valder BB Show. Thanks, Valder. It's so nice to be with you.